It is important for treatment plant personnel to know the approximate rate of screening accumulation for disposal purposes. The simplest way to determine the rate at which screening volume accumulates is to place the screenings that were collected during a 24-hour period in a container of known volume and divide by the flow. For example, if four cubic yards of screenings were collected during a 24-hour period and flow was 10 mgd, we would divide four cubic yards by the 10 million gallons that flowed that day. We would then discover that we were accumulating screenings at a rate of 0.4 cubic yards per million gallons of flow. This number can then be used for planning purposes. This same procedure can be followed for the grit removal process. Simply divide the amount of grit accumulated during a 24-hour period by the volume of water that flowed through the plant during that period and you'll determine the volume of grit for every million gallons of flow. This number may change during storm events since higher flow velocities in the collection system may bring additional grit to the treatment plant. It's a good idea to periodically perform a volatiles concentration test on the grit removed by the treatment plant as this will give you an idea of the organic concentration of the grit that's removed and help with your process control decisions. A composited sample made up of grit removed over the course of a full day is ideal to get a representative sample for this test. Regularly monitoring the volatile content of the grit will enable you to optimize the grit removal process based on solid data. A good record keeping system is essential for the long term operation and maintenance of a wastewater treatment plant. Every piece of equipment should have a maintenance record that contains all work performed on that piece of equipment, whether it be preventive or corrective in nature. In addition, notes should be made when abnormal conditions, malfunctions, or stoppages occurred with a piece of equipment. By keeping good records on equipment and regularly reviewing those records, sound budgeting decisions and preventive maintenance scheduling will be assured. Accurate grit and screening volume records are also vital to aid the operator in scheduling grit and screening disposal as well as budgeting for the cost of grit and screening disposal.